Hi there, this is Steve Meyer, the market chartist on behalf of forextraders.com and we're now going to look at both the Australian dollar and the uh, New Zealand dollar, both against the US dollar, both the spot FX rates in here, showing a, dis a disparate tone in here. So the Aussie dollar certainly setting up more negatively um, through late March into early April and then through the Easter holiday in here. Um, and we can see this whole sell off in here from um, the end of March into early April down to 74.69 created a more negative tone in here uh, with the, the push down through 74.87 and that leaves the risk for a still deeper correction back down through this recent low at 74.69 and for a more bearish theme so certainly a more negative tone here for the Australian dollar if we go back to the uh, daily chart in here you can see this kind of topping structure created double top pattern on the previous breach of 74.87 and again lowering here as we go um, into this week um, after the Easter holiday. Conversely, if we look at the New Zealand dollar in here on the intraday chart, the market's rebounded off this 69.10 level ahead of this 68.86 level. And then certainly this week so far, a resilient consolidation tone despite setting back here on Wednesday, still maintaining a more positive tone and we still see an upside bias here. And now if we go to the daily chart here, you can see the market having rejected the breakdown through this low here at 68.67, rebounding from 68.86 and again rebounding from ahead of there over the last week or so. So a kind of a differing tone in here for New Zealand dollar and Australian dollar. These markets usually moving more um, in the same direction, but certainly a more positive outlook for New Zealand dollar versus the US currency and a slightly more negative bearish outlook for the Australian dollar. This has been Steve Miley, the market chartist on behalf of forextraders.com and I wish you a great trading week.